Hello everyone and welcome. So in this tutorial I will show you how to make a simple countdown timer inside Unreal Engine 5 with C++. So I go to the header file of my character itself. I will declare two U properties. One is for seconds and the other one for minutes. So I say U property please edit anywhere. Blueprint read write and give you that a category of account time okay and let me copy all this sorry because i need another one and the first one i will call this as a float and this will be the seconds and i will make this by default 11 seconds the other one will be the minutes and the minutes it's not a float it's an oh, it's an integer and so i will do an int 32 and we'll call this as a minute and I will make this as a two minutes for example sorry two F so now I have a two properties one is for seconds and the other one for minutes now let me go and do the function that will be called count down okay this will make the count down down timer so let me create that definition and I need first of all to check now this in fact this count down timer will be called on the timer manager it will be repeated so it it will be stopped if the seconds and the minutes has reached if the minutes itself has been reached to zero so now I say if now if the seconds is more than zero and it's by default yes it's more than zero to increment these seconds okay now if the if the seconds is more than zero and it's on begin yes it's more than zero now if I say else if it's not that case decrease the minutes now please for me okay so by default if the seconds is more greater than zero decrement that if it's else decrement the minute so let me let me call this countdown timer on begin and play because i'm i'm doing this on every uh, timer on begin play okay so i will make a world time i will get the world timer manager so get world sorry get world timer manager dot set timer now I need a timer so let me go back and declare a timer handle maybe I have one let me go back yes I already create that as a u property as, as an f timer handle I prefix that with with, with uh, all my timer handle I will prefix that with, with th because later on I can search for for that and it will be easy for me so I will do this as a timer handle please use that timer handle and pass this as the caller and I will pass the function as an a gameplay character and I will call who I will this I will call this count timer countdown timer and by default 1.f seconds rate and yes please repeat that be a loop thing and every 1.5 1, 1 1.0 sorry second okay so every one second this timer is calling these functions okay so on begin play make a timer and keep repeating this count count down timer okay so it's so mouthful uh, let me go and where is my count down let me uh, no, okay the countdown timer on begin play is saying okay do you have a second yes please i have a second decrement that decrement that so it will it will keep decrement that all and when it's reached zero it's less than zero it will say hey and now it's time to remove a minute from that countdown timer okay and now and also I need to make a check uh, I will make them now the seconds go back the seconds now 
make that back to the default value for example this okay so i am checking if i have a minute yes i have a minute keep decrement that because this minute this seconds sorry it's it's 11 seconds so it will keep doing this after one point second delay and when it's reached less than zero it will go to this one and decrement that and reset back that seconds to 11 seconds okay and now i need to check now inside the minutes itself i also need to check and stop this timer from doing this over and over again now if the now if the minutes itself if the minutes itself now it has been reached to zero or let's say let me do this less than or equal to zero now please stop the timer and set the seconds to zero say seconds please go and make yourself as a as a zero and get world timer manager and now it's time to say please clear that timer handle that countdown okay so basically this is it on begin play on begin play i'm getting a world timer manager and set that timer set that timer manager f timer manager and call this countdown function every one second and it's keep looping and what it's doing is saying hey do you have a second yes i have a second keep decrement that and when you reached zero now sorry you don't you don't have any seconds now decrement the minutes and set back seconds to 11 minutes and this will go back to seconds and keep decrement that until the minutes itself has been reached zero and now clear the timer manager and set back the, that to zero and exit from that function so when you say clear and this timer will won't be called again okay so let me compile so it has been successfully compiled let me let me log that let me log like why not let me ue log uh, it's a uh, temp thing so log sorry log temp as a warning and i will pass the text macro and now it's time to say hey log the seconds and the seconds since that as a float i will pass in this and say pass the seconds let me copy that and to do that here and now it's time to pass an integer i need the d and pass the minutes okay and when the minutes has been reached less than or equal to zero exit from that timer manager and start begin play you can pause the player in fact you can pause the player from moving and make a bool variable and pause the player from moving and you can do this in many ways so let me also log this copy do this as this and let me remove these and call this the game begin okay so let me compile for the last time now it has been successfully compiled so let me now uh, go to the engine itself and play and watch the optimal log let me clear that and play and let me go back maybe it's not logging and now after i have compiled that from the engine itself maybe <sighs> Don't, didn't compile uh, very properly from from the IDE so let me compile that after I have compiled that successfully from the engine as a successful now I can go and play and see my seconds it's go from 10 9 7 6 5 4 these are the seconds and it's keep looping and when it's reached zero okay say minutes it's saying seconds because I let me go back let me stop because I didn't change the lock itself so yes call this as a minute these are a minute yes this is a minute please minutes let me go 
back and compile for the last time. Okay, so let me play now and say seconds, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 3, 4, 3, sorry, 2, 1, and has been reached 0, go to minute 1, because it, since it's, the minutes is 2 minutes, and now it will keep and increment the seconds until the minutes has been reached to 0, and say, hey, minutes is has been reached zero the game has begun okay so this is you can hook this as that okay I can do this because I did that behind the scenes also I have a widget let me see where's my widget there you are there's my widget go to the event graph and these my say my seconds and my minutes and seconds has been bind let me play and see I hooked that in the widget so six five four three two one zero and go decrement now the minutes has been gone and keep decrementing now the seconds and when the seconds has been reached zero and the minutes has been reached zero okay the game has become both are zero and the, the timer manager has been cleared and you has been complete the, uh, the, the countdown timer okay so this is about that so on the, let's keep looping that every one point second every one point okay and it's true looping and saying if the second is more than zero yes keep decrement that as soon as it's no longer it will be decrement the minutes and reset back the seconds so he will exit and go back to the seconds and keep decrement that and when the seconds itself also check now also on the else now if the sec if the minutes itself has been less than or equal to zero now the countdown timer has been cleared you you now can exit from this and say please get the timer manager and clear that clear that timer from that timer handle and reset back these seconds to zero and exit this timer okay so this is how you can make a countdown timer inside unreal engine 5 with c++